What's going on, everybody? Vince Goodrum here. It is Monday afternoon, and I know you guys have been wanting me to uh, co uh, comment on the whole Blaha situation and everything, uh, but there are some things that I've actually left out there. Uh, the truth of the matter is I've actually been in contact with the said individual. In fact, that person has contacted my office there uh, as recently as today here. And uh, actually, I had forgotten that my uh, business, business office actually records all conversations. So I probably have about 20 or 30 minutes of audio conversation with me speaking with her which unfortunately I cannot publish due to the state that I live in here. Not only that, it wouldn't be too cool there. So uh, if she's listening out there, uh, no worries, your information is safe. But as I explained to you, uh, if you want to be really heard, you do got to put that information out audio-wise. You can't just go and contact me or Vegan Gains about this whole Blaha situation. We are not your advocates or anything like that. But uh, I do feel, I'm going to be honest with you folks, I feel really sorry for her uh, situation there. And here's the thing, I'm just going to give you the details of the conversation here, okay? Uh, notwithstanding uh, most things, this is about uh, Blaha basically and allegedly lying to this person saying that he's a Christian guy and that the people that was messing with him online were leftist trolls, in other words. To which I explained to her in return uh, that those so-called trolls was actually trying to warn her about this person. I mean... There is like five years of stuff from Hemingway as far as his activities are concerned there. You know, like five, six, seven years all the way back there. You know, and I did scold her a little bit as far as to getting involved. And here's the thing, folks. Uh, if you decide to get involved with an Internet personality, please check the resources. Speak to other people about them, okay? Now, that's actually the reason why I haven't actually spoken about this whole Blaha situation. I have recordings and stuff like that. You know, if I went and put them on YouTube, I mean, I'm sure I... I mean, it's it would be some good coin for me. I'd probably get probably 50, 60,000, 100,000 views on it there. You know, which would equate to maybe about nine or nine hundred to a thousand dollars, but I'm not going to do that because the great one has integrity. You know what I'm saying? The great one has integrity. You know, so I will not publish those audio recordings unless she tells me and gives me permission to do so. But I explained to her unless she puts something out via audio or so forth or by video, it doesn't do diddly do squat. So I have all these recordings. I even have one in the email itself there. And I asked her why she doesn't want me to put anything out is because she was basically chickened out there. So I just wanted to put this video out explaining why I haven't put anything out about the Blaha situation, okay? Because I can't, I can't publish it. I mean, it would make me some good money there, but, you know, I can't put this stuff out there, you know? Uh, I simply can't. So I'm real sorry about it there, you know, and stuff like that. Hopefully she takes the advice that I gave her over the phone, uh, and actually put something out there, you know, because I explained to her good and well that, you know, we, I'm pretty much not her advocate. I'm already irritated that someone calls me on my business line while I'm working and everything like that. Uh, but I mean, with all due respect, you know, me, Richard, uh, or anyone else on YouTube, we're not your advocates here, okay? I can't go and put something out that you want, and, and I'm going to explain it to her, you and everybody else is concerned. Anything that's published about Blaha is simply going to be allegations. That's it there. They're just allegations. If I go 
and report on something that's considered allegations, that could be considered as libel and it could be considered as slander, you know. Uh, not only that, it takes away from my channel or so forth. So, uh, folks, it's not like I've been trying to, uh, it's not like I don't want to comment about the Blaha situation. It's just that I am pretty much frozen in doing so. I'm just going to be honest with you here. It has not, I mean, it's not like I, I, I would love to put out these recordings and stuff like that uh, about the whole situation. I just simply can't there, so I'm sorry. Maybe uh, she'll change her mind or so forth. I certainly hope so. Uh, but just wanted to give that out to all my fans there. It's not like I'm avoiding uh, talking about Hemingway or anything. You know, there's just some unique circumstances which I've just explained. That's all I got to say, folks. Like and subscribe to the Vince Goodrum channel. Click the link below. Peace and soul.